Hi, my name is Cassandra, and I've come from Texas uh, for plastic surgery. Cassandra, what made you decide to come overseas to Thailand for surgery instead of having it at home in Texas? For one, the cost, <laughs> obviously. Uh, for the procedures that I had done, had both my upper eyelids done and my breast done. Uh, for the total two-week time frame that I'm here, for the surgery, the hotel, everything, basically was the cost of just the breast augmentation in the States. If It would have cost probably a bit more in the States. Right, so did you go and see a plastic surgeon at the home or, or just uh, I research? I just did just research. And so what were your, uh, what did your friends and family say to you before you were coming over? Did they warn you against They thought I was out of my mind. <laughs> thought I had lost my mind completely. <laughs> and, and what did you tell them? I wasn't worried because um, I did do a lot of research um, on the hospital, on Bum Regard, and I spoke with some expat workers and all that I worked with, and they spoke very highly at the hospital that it was basically the number one hospital, you know, here in Thailand. So what were your first impressions when you first arrived? Wow. <laughs> That's the only way to explain it, you know, to describe it was wow. How did it compare to a hospital at home? To me, it was a lot better. Um, you walk in, you don't, you can't tell it's really a hospital. It does not have the hospital smell to it, but it's very, very clean. It's very sanitary. Um, the nurses, the doctors, their bedside manner is, I mean, just out of this world. I've had two children, I've had one surgery in the States, and none of those compared to this. You know, this one was just really out of this world. And what was your plastic surgeon like? How was he, his bedside manner? He and... was great. He was really fantastic. Uh, very professional you know, did not make me feel uneasy at all. Just very professional, and I like that. So how are you feeling now that the pain was at this? Did you feel as though you couldn't do it? How are you feeling now? Are you feeling like post-op? How many days are you post-op now? Uh, today's Friday. I'm a week and three days post-op. If I ran, I could probably run a marathon. <laughs> and that's saying a lot considering I'm 42 years old. Um, the first few days was, you know, it was, you know, pretty rough. The pain, there was pain there. I mean, you're going to have pain, obviously. You're having major surgery, things are having to expand and stretch and all that. Um, but now, there's really no pain. You know, you do have psychological things you do have to deal with. Because, like for me, there wasn't anything there really, and then all of a sudden there is. You know, there, so there's a lot of stretching. You know, I did have the numbness, but I'm I get, I have my feeling back now mm -hmm. in my breast. Um, it's great. I love them. <laughs> and my eyes are, you know, I had no problems. Um, at my first follow-up appointment, he took the stitches out. They had healed up, you know, just fabulous. And what do you think of Thailand as a destination? Oh, it's great. You know, uh, so much to see. I'm gonna have to come back <laughs> without having any surgery where I can use like the full couple of weeks to go out and see things. There's too much to see, too much to do. You know, just, it's great. Um, Arisan Villa is, it's a beautiful, serene, you know, peaceful place. Yeah, so what do you think of the, the hotel that you're staying at for your post-op recovery? Uh, the Arisong Villa? Yes. It's great. You know, just very peaceful, very serene. The staff, they're, they're wonderful. 
you know, I mean, I feel like a princess. <laughs> the way they cater. <laughs> it's like, can I take them home with me? <laughs> and the food at the hotel and then the... It's, it's really good, um, surprisingly. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm not vegetarian, I like my meat. <laughs> But it is it's delicious, very tasty. What about the uh, the massages? Um, I got I've received two massages so far. The first one it was okay. The second one I received here, and I loved it. Um, to me, the second one here at the Arisam Villa relaxed me a lot more. I received that after the surgery, and it seemed like the muscles up in you know, the top of my breast area, and even all around it, um, helped to relax them a lot better, even though they didn't even touch the top half of me. So, did you organize this yourself, or did you have a, a facilitator company help you arrange everything, or? No, I went with a global travel company. And would you recommend others to use Global Health Travel? Oh, most definitely. <laughs> it, I did start to do it all myself, to go through the hospital myself and, you know, arrange the surgery myself, the hotel, air travel and all that. And it would have just been too much of a hassle. It, going through Global Health, it just, it took away the headache, the stress, of trying to coordinate everything and all that. I mean, it's just made it so stress-free. It really has. Well, we hope to. Do you think you'll come back again? Oh, most definitely. <laughs> well, we, we look forward to seeing you when you come back again. Thank you, Cassandra. Thank you.